When I was 13 years old, I came here with my godparents, Joe and Nina Bustolini, and my uh, sister, Susanna. Joe, who was my stepfather growing up, he, uh, he was lieutenant colonel in the Air Force. I call him my father. That's where I took my middle name, Joe. And uh, he was lieutenant colonel in the Air Force. He, uh, he came in as an E-1, and he retired as an O-5. Damn. He came in in 1936 and retired in 1956. Jeez. He got promoted on uh, Pearl Harbor. Pearl Harbor happened, you know, you didn't have to get any kind of college. He had, and he had no college. He went from E-1 to O-6, uh, E-1 to O-5. E-1 to O-5, no college. Damn. Lieutenant Colonel Joe leadership Bustolini. Skills. Just leadership skills. Yeah. And you know what? He was in the 8th Air Force, and you know what he did? I'd love to tell you he was a B-17 pilot. He was a finance officer. Really? <laughs> <laughs> he was a finance officer. Damn. But you know what? He was like, man, I had some really tough jobs. You know, each one of those air crews is like 10 guys. He had to, like, package up all their shit and send it back to their families. Oh, damn. So that was, like, pretty traumatic. And then he had, he had all these uh, reunions with the 8th Air Force. 96 Heavy Bomb Group. In fact, I still have his identification. I still have, you know, that fucking motherfucking cop, he fucking took the, his uh, lieutenant colonel chevron. That's why I want to get that fucking lieutenant. All the other stuff is like, you know, 200 bucks maybe, but. One and a half miles. We're going to be getting off here. Fucking cop. Man. Joe Robustolini. United States Army Air Corps. And he was a Jesuit priest. First Jesuit priest. He was a chaplain to the Israeli Army. Joe Robustolini was the first Catholic chaplain to the Israeli Army. Hoorah! Hoorah. 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 Well, yeah, because he was a fucking Army soldier. Hoorah. Whatever. Now the Navy says who ya? Who ya? We got a half mile, we're getting off another line. No, you know the Navy right. the Navy on the submarine say hoorah because yeah. Sahara Avenue, that's her exit. Yeah. Yeah, you know that latest uh, submarine movie? The one with that uh, new actor? Uh, they say hoorah. Oh really? Yeah, I forgot what the name that looked like a pretty good submarine movie too. I gotta get it. I'm gonna and get it on. Once we get off, we're gonna take a Go back. Yeah. I need to get one of those uh, Google uh, Chromecasts so I can play that shit. So we're going to take a left up here. Oh, holy fuck. Fuck you, buddy. Because <laughs> I got two fucking Navy Corpsmen and I got a freaking. <laughs> I got a fucking, I got an AR-15 and I got friggin' three Glocks. And I will fucking put one right between your fucking eyes, you fucking bitch. Plus I got a fucking breakdown 9mm carbine that takes Glock, Glock clips. <laughs> With a aim point and a fucking suppressor on it. Push that fucking 147 grain slug right in the back of your skull at around 1500 feet per second. Right through the back, friggin'. Window with that fucking Raptor truck, <laughs> completely suppressed. Four <laughs> miles. Of course, I could do that with a fucking 1022 also. <laughs> I've never seen a palace station.